Okay, so now let's go. First off, let's do this. Another fine day behind us. Nice night out. Here's the plan. Snorpy basically can't see without his glasses, and I know he cleans them every day at five. So we'll approach him then, and if I'm green and I say bro a lot, he'll think I'm Chandlo. And obviously Snorpy isn't gonna keep Chandlo's secrets from himself. Yeah. You know it, bestie. Snorpy isn't gonna know what hit him. Let's hang out until it's time. <clears throat> hey, Snorp Dog. Can I, like, ask you something? Chandlow, is that you? I can't see. Let me get my glasses. Oh, uh, there's no time, bro. This is important. Oh, uh, well, all right then. What is it? Bro, you remember that deep, dark secret we were talking about? You know, the really super secret one? Oh, ah. Uh... That, yes, I suppose it is time we talked about it. Chandlo, it's hard for me to know what you're thinking, and I've been afraid of talking about it for so long, but the truth is, Chandlo, I, I love you with every fiber of my heart. <laughs> That's not a secret to anybody. Befika, when did you get here? How dare you intrude on our private moment? Uh, bro, she just... Ran off, dog. Like, I'm gonna go chase her, bro. Hello? Chandler? Anybody? Here's to a hard ah. day's work. <sighs> Chandler buried his dirt so deep, not even Snorpy knows about it. Or he's actually good. I've spent my whole career looking into the good ones and finding out who they really are. And like, I'm always the one who suffers for telling the truth. Every friend I ever had dropped me as soon as I told them something they didn't want to hear. And it's no different here. The only upside to being stuck on this island, 
At least I have bug snacks to keep me company. I don't know. I like you because we're similar. I'm a Leo like that. Can I really trust you? There's plenty of time to find out, but... I'd probably be a lot happier if I didn't know. Ah, nothing like getting to Alright. What's next? Um... Go find Shelter. Hey, bro! Just got done fixing up the old bridge. Would have done it sooner, but Cromdo wanted me to pay him for the rights of repair. Whatever that means. Anyway, no need to thank me. Just go find Shelda, all right? Alrighty. Contest, that's what I need. Breakfasty bets. For pepper. Mm, this one has many questions. So it is my wisdom shall be shared. Am I? One who is called Shelda exists beyond the cell. What is your deal? Ah, the questions must cease. Wisdom can be gained only through experience. One who is you, tainting others with the toxin that is bug snacks, has strayed from the mother's path. So it is. You must atone. In seeking inner peace, Shelda has renounced material temptations. So it is that Shelda is really grumping hungry. Seek the yellow sauce within the great maw of stone. On this, I shall be sustained. <laughs> Get cheese sauce.
Pop Chakra! Oh my god, no. I guess that way. Yum is one, and one is craving reapers. Consider the sandscape a reflection of the mind. One unable to escape its dry embrace. First, an act of rebirth to break out of my current shelter. So too must you break shells, crack open the egglers, give them new life. Crack two egglers. <laughs> oh, I see one. How am I supposed to?
That's not gonna work. I was honestly caught by accident, but it actually works out in my favor. Oh, there one cracked too? What the hell? I too have burst from my shell and so oozes forth my spiritual yoke. Yet obstacles devour that yoke, the sinister peccantis of temptation. To truly destroy these obstacles, one must break them down into their elements. down here. Black Rasby. There is an Intrito.
All right. I think that's all I need for... Yeah. And Graham will need to prank uh, the contest too. Like cheat sauce also. Let's do for that quest line. Pick that back up. Genuinely a route I didn't think I'd be taking. I worked out of it here. Because it's because it's 
Can I leave and come back and that one be respawned? Don't try and say. Okay. Snack of temptation removed. <laughs> Yet, one still lost in darkness, seeking the light. For only in the light of Mother Nature can the toxin be purged. <gasps> Seek a rasby deep below. A hidden ruin, a maze of trials. Guide this Rasby to one's side. I gotta guide the Rasby all the way over to her. I mean, they gotta break out the trusty bugger ball. Oh. 
was lost now is found the path to light determined the time has come egress from the sandscape so it is that shelter survives it was a metaphor now to snacksburg goes me to bring such clarity to my followers all right, now she's back. My grumpy butt is so sore. Oh, note to self. Get a chair. So now, retrieve that. We don't need that anymore.
Go all the way back to Snacksburg and donate these. still having to have. Hello, Tiffany. Nice to see ya. Okay, turn You've done right by me, stranger. Thanks for sticking with me. Come back tomorrow. We'll see if this bears fruit. All right. Crondo, how are you today? Yeah. Hi. Hmm. Oh, hi there. Hi. Is it Wambus later? Welp, they came out of the ground all right. Guess I didn't bury them deep enough. Damn. What am I supposed to do if even I don't believe in me? I didn't come to this island to be free or to live off the land. I'm here because I couldn't make it over there. Deep down, I'm a failure. It's all right. I knew it all. Well, I still got my sauce. It's not bug snacks, but it's not nothing. Maybe I'm just stubborn enough to call that a win. All right, back to noon time. Because I believe Sure are biggins. Well, no matter what size, there's always room for more in my family. I'm sure they'll fit in just fine. <laughs> I gotta come back to him later. Just follow the pointer and... Oh! Wait! Come back! Manny! But Natalie's name! Oops. They... They left me. <laughs> I guess that's just what family does. They're never around. Barely ever talk to you. Then one morning you wake up and they're gone without so much as saying goodbye. I thought bug snacks would be simple. They don't have it in them to be cruel. But the cruelest thing you can do is not care at all. Oh, maybe I should pay Wiggle a visit. Uh, after I fix the fence, of course.
Nice night out. Whoa, Shelda's back. Wiggle and Gramble are gonna be so stoked. Ah, oh, yes, Swan has returned from a great spiritual sojourn. So it is. One would really like to lie down. Sounds intense. I bet you're overflowing with wisdom now. Go ahead and lay it on me, Shell Dog. Ah, oh, yes, uh, wisdom. Um, <laughs> the strength you seek cannot be found within toxins, for the truest strength is the will to resist. Oh, I get it. I gotta check my snacks, and if they look toxic, I won't eat them. No, one is not. You... Oh, clearly you need more guidance. Grumpy, yeah, I do. I'll bring the others, too. Oh, one is sure it will be enlightening. When one asks questions, one may receive answers. All right. One is called Shelda. A one who is me acts as a vessel for the will of Mother Nature. So it is. One maintains balance and purity. I come snack. <gasps> a calling felt in the soul. Distant voices saying they need you. Free tickets won in a raffle. A, a raffle is a metaphor. Uh, but yes. Got some boy snacks. Toxin. The mother abhors them in all their alluring forms. One feels them crawling around us, beneath us, inside us. Who is the mother anyway? Mother Nature! The mother! She, the purest light from whom all life flows. Why do we tell? One cast out they, the scion of toxins. Yet, lessons unlearned, the cravings only grew. So it was one journeyed far to isolate oneself and live by example. So it was. One got very, very lost. Any of them was for the huntress is gone from us, strayed from the mother's path, chasing the healer's tainted love. Thrice were they warned, so this once you shall be warned. A doom befalls those who consume the toxin. A doom of toxin unending. The ground shakes, the sky splits! Look not upon it, move not an 
inch or be swallowed by the Queen of Venom. Or so I heard. You're a fraud, aren't you? Everyone is a fraud in a sense. Ever are more questions asked, seldom are more answers given. One must live content with the absence of knowing. Meditate on this. A vessel of the unknown. May answers be found in its mystery. Haha. -ha. So now we have, I guess we just gotta do Agabelle's mission and return her to Snacksburg, and that'll be everybody. Crown don't need me to get a buff locust, and Sheldon needs something now. One sees you. You who continues to spread the toxin's dark influence are lost. But one will guide you to the true path. Behold, the box of purity. Those box nuts placed inside shall be purged by the light of Mother Nature. Make an offering to the box. Show that you are willing to walk this path. <laughs> Offer a bug snack to the box. A wise choice was made. So it is. The light that shines within darkness shines brightest of all. Meditate on this and return one day hence. Okay. Let's talk again. So it is. The toxins are no more. Should we eat those bugs next? One 
is pure. One would never be tempted by such poison. This is why one sits in meditation every day for six hours, repeating the mantra. Don't think about bug snacks, don't think about bug snacks, don't think about bug snacks. And so it is, one never thinks about bug snacks. Ever the work? sun rises, ever are more toxins left to be purified. In dreams each night, one sees inch wraps, cheeses, and peel bugs. This vision must be the will of the mother. So it is. You must bring them to the box of purity. <laughs> oh. Oh. Offer an inch wrap and a cheeser and a green peel bug. Hey, pal! Hi! How's it hanging? Hi, Tambo. Hey there! <sighs> what do I have in terms of bug snacks right now? Lotus Buddy and a flat jackarax. What's going on, Wiggle? Hey there. Hi, Gramble. Oh, hi. All right. Sup? Go back to Sugar Pine next. Real quick, I want to catch um, a couple more honeybees to donate. Oh, damn. Back, donate these real quick. That way I can expand my storage space or my capturing section. Hey Tripany, what's going on? Nice to see you. How's it going? Alright. Okay. 